Hi, I'm Philip from Optimize Lab, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about the Maximize Conversions bidding strategy. I'm going to go through how to set up the bidding strategy, when you should be using this bid strategy, and also why it's not necessarily the best bidding strategy to be used by the majority of advertisers. So keep watching. So to start off with, when should you be using the Maximize Conversions bidding strategy? Well, you should be using this bid strategy firstly in the case where you know how much you'd like to be spending per day through your campaign. So you have your budget for your campaign set. Now, you also, in order to get the most out of this bidding strategy, you want to have at least 30 conversions within the last 30 days. If you don't have uh, that level, that volume of conversion data, then the bidding strategy is not going to be able to make effective decisions on where to adjust bids in order to maximize the number of conversions that you're getting within your daily budget. Now, you also want to be using this bid strategy in the case where you do not yet have an idea, a solid idea of how much you'd like to be paying per conversion or how much you'd like to be generating as a return on your ad spend. Um, this bid strategy is effective for getting information and finding out how much you'd like to be generating per conversion uh, to, to decide on what your target CPA is going to be. And then later down the line, you can use a more effective smart bidding strategy like target CPA or target ROAS. So that's the case where you'd like to be using and where it's best to be using maximize conversions or maximize conversion value. And I'll show you next how to set up this bid strategy. Okay, so how do you set up the Maximize Conversions bidding strategy? Well, you can do that quite simply by clicking on the campaign that you'd like to set up the bidding strategy for. And then navigating on the left-hand menu to Settings. And then clicking on the Bidding option. And you can then click here, change bid strategy. And in the top menu, you have a selection of the bidding strategies. And here we have the option of maximize conversions or maximize conversion value. And these two bidding strategies work quite similarly, but are used in different cases. So maximize conversions will be used for campaigns that generate conversions that all have uh, pretty much the same value. So if you're tracking form fills, people uh, filling out the contact form on your website, or people who are making phone calls, and um, all of these conversions are tracked with the same value, then you use maximize conversions because all of the conversions, as far as the system is concerned, have the same value. Now, if instead you have an e-commerce website and you're selling products and those products have different price points, then you want to be using maximize conversion value because the system is going to be... Um, getting the data on how much each individual is purchasing the volume of sales rather than just looking at the number of conversions, the number of sales, it's looking at the sales volume, the dollar amount, for example, um, of the sales. Um, and it's going to maximize that sales value. So it's going to be giving more weighting towards those conversions that result in a higher purchase value which is obviously going to be beneficial eventually for your bottom line so if you have an e-commerce website use uh, you can you can opt to use maximize conversion value if you're just generating leads or all of your conversions have the same value then select maximize conversions um, and it's really that simple um, now you can also set up a portfolio bidding strategy um, and you can do that by um, going to tools and settings and then selecting bid strategies and then from here you can create a new bidding strategy um, by clicking uh, 
just that button there and then you can choose maximize conversions you can give a name to your bidding strategy and then you can even select the campaigns that you would like to apply the bid strategy to so we're just going to type in maximize conversions here and save and it's really that simple and from here you can then see the data that's been generated uh, to see how well the bid strategy is performing how many conversions you're generating within your daily budget now you may have noticed earlier in this video that i mentioned that maximize conversions is not necessarily the best bidding strategy to be used for the majority of advertisers and i'm going to explain why that is now so with maximize conversions you generally don't get the same performance the same number of conversions even generated within your budget as you would do if you are using target CPA. So if you can get to the stage where you um, have an idea of how much you'd like to be paying per conversion, then you can start using target CPA bidding strategy and it's generally more effective, the algorithm, the, the way the bidding strategy, the small bidding strategy works, more effective at generating more conversions within your budget than using maximize conversions. So maximize conversions is good for getting to a stage where you have that data, you, you've been generating a lot of conversions and you now have developed an idea, okay, this is how much I'd like to be paying for a conversion in, in order to be profitable and maximize um, the revenue that I'm generating through my campaign. And then once you set that bidding strategy, sorry, once you set that target CPA, you can then adjust it. So I'll show an example here. So this is a target CPA bidding strategy that's been set up for a client. Um, and you can adjust the target here, which has been adjusted for this. And you can see that the actual CPA um, is lower than the target so when you set a target the bidding strategy is still going to try if possible to achieve a lower target so if you set that target this target for example was previously set at 35 pounds per conversion which is in line with the objectives of the client but the bidding strategy has still achieved a lower target is still managed to generate even more conversions within that daily budget um, than would be if we were hitting that higher target. So we're generating more conversions. And what we can do is we can either even reduce that target that we've set to see if we can generate even more conversions within that budget. And another thing that I found, um, and which is quite often seen, with maximized conversions is that that bidding strategy will push past the daily budget cap that you set for your campaign more often. And although the campaign will um, spend whatever your daily budget is um, times the um, 30 days, the 30 day duration to make sure that you hit um, on average that daily budget within a given month although that is true it is possible with the way budgets work for the campaign to exceed your daily budget by two times um, and that can happen a lot more often with maximized conversions than it does do with target CPA so target CPA um, does give you a lot more control it can enable you to generate more conversions despite the name given to maximize conversions I believe you're more likely to maximize the number of conversions within your budget by using target CPA so that's why maximize conversions is not the best bidding strategy to use for most advertisers it can be good to generate data in the beginning before you've set those goals but it's good if you can to set those goals as soon as possible come up with an um a target cpa as soon as possible so you can begin using the target cpa bidding strategy and get heightened performance 
through your campaign. So I hope this video has been informative and useful for you. If it has, then feel free to subscribe for more tips um, and more um, useful guides on setting up your marketing campaigns. And thank you for watching.